Well, it could hit store shelves in a matter of months, but tonight there's a push to keep Palcohol from ever making it that far. The powdered form of alcohol, Palcohol, is waiting for federal approval. Tori Wells explains why some high-level government leaders say it's time to pull the plug. Alcohol sold as powder? It could be on the market soon, but Senator Chuck Schumer says it's a bad idea. Tonight we're asking why and finding out what this product is. This is how much palcohol comes in a package. Palcohol, or powdered alcohol, is a product this man soon hopes to sell. But Senator Chuck Schumer hopes that doesn't happen. It became clear that palcohol would soon become the Kool-Aid of teenage binge drinking. He says it would be easier to abuse, conceal, and mix with food and other drinks. Some other local leaders and experts agree. We got heroin issues. Quite honestly, folks, this is just going to be another issue. We are above the national average for alcohol use, and it is the number one drug of choice for our youth. Schumer is now calling on the FDA to step in and ban the sale of alcohol. They can ban a substance that they feel is dangerous. We need to act now before ignorance determines our future. Mark Phillips, the creator of Palcohol, has launched a counterattack, calling Senator Schumer's information inaccurate. He released this video on YouTube that he says is to set the record straight. This is the bag that Palcohol will come in. Phillips says in this video that the package is too big to conceal, that it would be sold like typical alcohol, so it wouldn't be easy for kids to get. And he says claims it can be snorted aren't realistic. I'm a parent, so it's something I would like further looked into if it's going to be on the street when my kids are around. People we spoke with say they don't think they'd buy it. But one man said if the FDA thinks it's okay, then the company should probably have a chance. If it's safe and approved and it's sold specifically in uh, liquor stores, then I think it should be sold. Here in New York, lawmakers have introduced a bill in case that does hit the market. It would only allow it to be sold to people who are older than 21. We did reach out to the company today, but we haven't heard back. In the newsroom, Tori Wells, CBS 6 News.